the soundtrack of a better world. We are one. Welcome to the Progressive Birdhouse. This year is absolutely flying by. I am bird one of Avian Invasion. And it looks like, oh, well, it looks like Lumi is a little behind the ball, but you heard it in the countdown. All aboard the hype train. As a matter of fact, that hype train is already inside of level three. Thanks to the generous contributions of Alpha Wolfio, Impistry, Wildcard 9, Fuzzy Jerg, Isfa, Matt C188, and of course, Jackal W404 for kicking it off with five gift subscriptions. So, we're going to start with an engine shot if somebody wants to. Oh, Impistry has spun that wheel. Of course, if we make it to a caboose shot, I got a couple of special things to unbox right here on the show. So, let's do this, shall we? engine shot is brought to you by zero key wolf longtime subscriber and a wonderful wonderful person despite what they might tell you this comes from the, to the colorado sake company their horchata nigori i am tearing through these little bottles and i entirely have you to blame for it oh for some reason it thinks we're on hype train level one Let's fix that, shall we? That's more like it. Looks like Lumi has been doing shots before I did. So, oh my God. I am not doing a clam juice shot. As a matter of fact, this is some fantastic sake. So thank you so much for getting things started off quickly and enthusiastically. Cheers to you, my friends. We don't even have our full viewer count yet. And you guys are kicking ass. Oh man, but this hype train's about to end five seconds. So here you go. Cheers, my friends. I can do either your life. I turn my back for literally one second. Rock Pop tosses out five gift subscriptions, and that pushes us into level four. Resetting that clock, my friends. Holy cow. So what this means is the next track is going to be an original track. And I'm going to stop talking over the vocals here. So thank you so very, very much for getting things started right.
little something. Something currently only available at avianinvasion.com slash Patreon. But I'm going to push this one out to the masses sometime this year. This is Someday May. Seconds left in that train with less than 9% to reset the clock and zero in on that caboose shot. Down it goes. We're starting level five now. now and i know there's at least one new person here in the chat so how this works is if we bust any multiple of level five we take a caboose shot and i got something really special to unbox for you if we make it that far
Once again, we find ourselves at 60 seconds left on that clock. And with another subscription from Draxfer and a couple hundred bits from Industry, we've hit it. Hype Train Level 5. Alrighty, once we get to the end of this track, I will crack open that caboose shot. Of course, if you make it to level 10 in the next, you know, two minutes, which I don't think is going to happen, well, then I'll have to bust a couple of things out. But thank you so very much. held over the weekend and apparently even though I did not head to Atlanta and I did not attend we got some presents got a couple of bottles here from Ciala who I believe is in the chat right now I believe they're re- partially responsible for starting this whole hype train off you still got three and a half minutes to see how far you can push it but let's unbox these suckers shall we Found you, bubble wrap. Can you outsmart my talons? Oh, we're going to find out, aren't we? You know, I should just do this like a kid at Christmas and shred it with no mercy whatsoever. Oh, yes. Oh, very yes. So from Muddy River Distillery, Ciala has brought us coffee rum. Coffee rum. There's nothing about these two I don't like. All righty. You know, I should have brought a knife. I should just use my beak. But I don't want to get tape all over it, you know. Ah, there we go. Oh, I can hear the bubble wrap popping. Satisfaction. Ah, yes, it has been quite some time since we've had this in the studio. Muddy River's basil rum, the rum that started it all here. Alrighty, so since we've done the basil rum before, I'm not going to open this one just yet. But now that we're inside of Hype Train level 6, 15% of the way through with a couple of minutes left on that clock to go for a shot of coffee let's see how this does shall we thank you so very much once again for pushing it all the way to level five and beyond oh look at that it even looks like cold brew but i bet it kicks a little harder than your average cold brew so we're pushing it to level five so very quickly and just in the first 15 minutes of the show here Cheers to you, my friends, and a huge thank you to Ciala for sending some new and interesting flavors my way. Let's see how this one goes. Oh, that is dangerous. That's almost up there with the uh, the Mr. Black that Origami Griffin has sent me a couple of times. Oh, that tastes an awful lot like coffee. And it is 60 proofs, so not quite full liquor strength, but I'm okay with that considering how many shots I end up doing on the show here. 45 seconds left in that train, and it is time to move on to bigger and better musicses. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is so good. I can't wait till the basil comes back around as well. Those two are now part of the regular uh, uh, shot rotation, so anytime a 
random shot or a hype train shot comes up, those are on the table. But I got a couple other things to unbox for you later in the show. Oh, and that will do it. We have reached the end of this train inside of level six. A thousand thanks to all of you for pushing it that far. That's 20 gift subscriptions and 1,400 bits thrown my way. Thank you for supporting the show. Thank you for supporting the new music hour, which is coming up in the second hour here. And thank you for supporting the new studio fund, which is coming along nicely, I might add. We just finished designing the drywall and framing layout for the inner box. That means it's time to buy a shit ton of lumber and get to work. what those uh, extra shot things were that were appearing underneath the hype train overlay. And uh, speaking of which, by the way, I'm not redoing my overlays and I'm not redoing my setup until I am moved into that new studio that I'm building in the backyard. And thank you once again for your help in making all of this possible. We're about 20 grand into this build with... Uh, uh, sorry, uh, 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 coming close to 30 grand into this build. It has been a long journey, but soon I will have a proper studio to make my little thumping noises. In any case, so you were wondering about that, those uh, little shot things. Well, 
to give you a hint of what's uh, what's coming with the next unboxing here. Every $500 into that tip jar goal for a new Mac Studio. That's a computer, by the way, not a building. We've got barrel-aged Malort and something else. This is Avian Invasion. Firebird here in the chat now. A thank you to you, by the way, for sending another 40 box of Stroopwafels. All birds like crackers, whether they are parrots or eagles. And these are the fanciest crackers on planet Earth. Thank you so very much for topping me off. Looks like we're digging into them right now. Why not? Thank you very much, Industry, for spending those seeds of awesomeness for a little stroopage. Oh my god. 
God, these are so incredibly tasty. You have no idea. If you can find these anywhere, go get you some.
God, yeah, I forgot to turn the guitar back on. I could hear it inside my bird face. Uh, but I wasn't sending it out to the house. Normally on like a big stage, it's not a problem because I can feel the rumbling when it goes out through the main speakers. Here in the studio, it's a little harder to tell. So sorry about that, but thank you so much for pointing it out to me. And of course, if you want to grab this one, head to avianinvasion.com slash St. Helens. It's available on Spotify, YouTube, Apple Music, Tidal, and of course Beatport. Pretty much anywhere dance music is sold, streamed, or enjoyed. All in honor of a mountain that's actually closer to our favorite Derg, Andraconix, who's on her way home from here right now after working her tiny ass off at FWA. Oh, it's Caliph. All right. Thank you very much for that. It's very hard to see little bitty text going by. Especially when the I's and the L's all kind of look the same. So here's a perennial favorite on this show. Waiting for the break of dawn To find the lies beyond the dawn I have set it from my way Passing the lakes and the broken caves And I see the world when the night is done Go down to the river in the blazing sun Blazing sun, blazing sun Blazing sun Go down to the river in the blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Blazing sun Go down to the river in the blazing sun Go down to the river in the blazing sun song and as you say you will never tire of it because i will never stop playing it i abuse this poor track i apologize for nothing go 
Fuzzy Dirk has pointed out, we have just passed 75 viewers, which is the magic number for Twitch on our path to partner. So that means if we stay above 75, I'll keep going until the hard cutoff time is 6.30 if I must. Coming up in about 15 minutes is the new music hour, and we got new tracks coming at you from Tom Baker, EDX, Funkadelica, Glowall, Kappa, Stan Kalev, one of my favorites, and the unstoppable Armin Van Buren. We got a couple of requests as well coming in from Pup Casey, and we will absolutely make those happen. All happening in the second hour here.
are beautiful. You are not alone. Free your mind.
chat. Oh, thank you very much to Matt C188 for tossing in 690. Nice. Into that tip jar at avianvasion.com slash tip jar. As I said earlier, we're trying to raise funds for a new computer, and you guessed it, we got some new things coming at you. As rewards, every time we hit a milestone, every $500 on that journey, we're doing a shot of something special. And it looks like most of you want me to reveal what that's going to be, but that poll has not ended yet, so we'll see that shortly. show you what's in the next bag just before the new music hour begins I haven't looked in there yet myself but given the shape of what I felt in that bag I have a sneaking suspicion of what's about to happen set you aside and figure out just what we're doing here. So in another little gift basket here, we've got something from Palmetto Distillery, which is very familiar. Hmm, where have I seen that name before? Oh, yes. Very lovingly. Thankfully, not bubble wrapped. Oh, my. What is all this? 
There we go. All right, so some thick tubes, as it were. Oh, you can see the label through it. I think I know what's going on here. Lovingly wrapped by Impistry here in the chat. And wrapped. And wrapped. And wrapped. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> so we've got bootlegger proof. This is 130 proof. Palmetto Moonshine. Unaged corn spirits right there. And as you can see, it's been labeled for me already. The Stream Ender. Caution only for milestones. And that is the goddamn truth. This is legitimately flammable. So I gotta make sure I don't open it too close to the lights back here and definitely not near the, uh, the color blaster. So we now have legitimate bona fide moonshine back on deck here. But of course, that's only happening if we make it past certain milestones. Even comes with a sippy cup lid. How lovely. But there's... But wait, there's more. Industry not to be outdone. Sent another bottle along as well. Oh, oh. Oh, look, it's another mason jar. Who knew absolute... Unbridled trouble came in such folksy, old-timey packages. Ah, uh, what have we here? Ah, the Milestone Moonshine. Caution only for milestones. This is a little lighter fare. This is what we had last time here on the show. It's only 105 proof. So we now have a couple of moons shine with which to toast. But of course, only if we make it past one of the $500 marks there on the tip jar. So I'll tell you what, if we make it to the halfway point, I'm trying the hard stuff. Once we make it to 2,500, it'll be another barrel aged Malort shot. When we make it to three grand, I will go a little lighter. And then another Malord shot at 3,500. And when we make it to four grand clean, and it's time to buy a new machine for the studio here, we're combining the forces of evil for a 130 proof Moonlord shot. I'm making these promises here and now, and they are being recorded so you can rub my nose in it, my beak in it anyway, if I try to back out later. So thank you very, very much to both Ciala and Impistry for sending some new things my way. I always love these little journeys, even if I hate what they do to me sometimes. We'll see how much it corrupts my programming, but only if we make it there. Oh, when we get to 4K, I think you should finish the bottle off. Yeah, well, thankfully I don't operate on what you guys think. I operate on what's sensible. In any case, y'all know what time it is. New music. Join Avian Invasion and explore the hottest new sounds in trance, progressive, and more. Every week, the new music hour begins now. So like I said, we got a whole hour of brand new tracks coming at you. In fact, this one is from one of my all-time favorite producers, Dark Synthy Moody. Stan Kalev brings you Boundless.
Mission detected. Shutting down non-essential system. Hour is coming at you from Armin Van Buren. Ah, excuse me, Armin Van Buren and Hertz, H R R T Z, with Julia Church on the vocals. This is Fire with Fire. i 
over to Gatiso. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce that one. And uh, Jaja. Jalja? Yalja? Uh, you got me on that one. But I am out of my mind. And now so are you, right here in the New Music Hour. for requesting a little guitar there. That was... I've actually never uh, spun that song up before. Uh, that was a fun one to riff on, but we head now to EDX with Renaissance. Not Renaissance. Renaissance. It's almost 420 here in the Seattle area, and we are in the new music hour. So thank you very much for that earlier hype train, all those subscriptions and bits. Pay for all this new music.
chat here and it looks like uh, for some reason twitch is having trouble getting those trains started it must be uh, headquartered in massachusetts for the uh, mbta but i digress to call him acrowolf is not to be outdone specifically requesting one of the newcomers here for a random shot so it's time for a wednesday afternoon toast with this lovely gift from Ciala. Muddy River Distillery's Basil Rum. That's assuming it doesn't take me until the end of the new music hour to get the label off. There we go. That's better. The seal. It vexes me. Do me a favor and join me at avianinvasion.com slash join because these will be available in the merch store sometime soon after we send them out to my entourage members at avianinvasion.com slash Patreon. We're working on a shirt design right now to go with that little uh, gift package, which all of the officers will get, but the entourage members get glassware. So cheers to you, Takala, and your impatience. And also cheers to you, Siala, for your generosity in liquid form. Cheers, my friends. Oh, that is as good as I remember it. Sweet, basily, just a hint of rum. The quality is outstanding. And do not worry, Loku, your 2,000 seeds of awesomeness. Oh, that burns a little bit, actually. The 2,000 seeds of awesomeness did not go unnoticed. They did not disappear into the ether. It just took me quite a while to get into a key that I've actually written something in. As a matter of fact, we interrupt this new music hour for... An Avian Invasion Original. This is a little track that I released on Bass Rebels Records. As a matter of fact, I believe it's the first track I released with Bass Rebels. This is Uncharted Skies.
very much to Fuzzy Dirt for uh, tossing out a gift subscription to one of our newcomers, Loku. Can't wait to see what you're bringing over tonight. Apparently he was handed a growler and said to show up here for our uh, Wednesday beer tastings. If we do make it to that moonshine shot, I may only be able to have a sip or a siplet of it. Getting on board as well, tossing one out to Spider Means. Assistance. It looks like this next hype train is in fact leaving the station. We're already 68% of the way through level one with very little left to go and four and a half minutes to do it. To so call Wolf is on the ball and already spun that wheel of shots. And it looks like we're doing the hibiscus, the blueberry hibiscus sake from Colorado Sake Company. So there's a few newcomers here. This is how this works on this channel. Every time a hype train starts, we start with an engine shot. If we make it past level three, I'll bring you another original track. And of course, if we make it past any multiple of level five thereafter, we cap it with a caboose shot. And it looks like he just busted through level one because Natolu tossed out 10 gift subscriptions. That deserves reverb. Technically, it's delay, but whatever. So I'm going to let the new music hour continue here with Train to Yakin. Seems fitting now that we're in a hype train, and it's already made it to level four because of this. Holy cow. So I better rack up that shot as the new music hour progresses. The clock is reset with four and a half minutes left. How far will it go? We'll see. Time to bust out the shot glass once again, my friends. the blueberry hibiscus sake from Colorado Sake Company. Thank you once again to Zero Key Wolf for sending these my way. These are so good. American-made sake. Let's make it purple, shall we? That train is rolling fast. Halfway through level four already, and it literally just started. So thank you, my friends, for all of your support, your love, and for most of all, believing in me. Because that's something that needs to be passed on to more people, honestly. Just let somebody know that you believe in what they're doing. You'd be surprised, even those of us who look confident in where we're going and what we're doing need that reassurance now and again. And whenever you kick off a hype train here, it doesn't just fuel my liver, it doesn't just fuel 
Well, obviously, the new music and the studio building, it's reassuring. It tells me I'm on the right literal track. So cheers to you, my friends, for spreading the good vibes week after week after week. Send that love to somebody else once you're done with this stream. And who knows, they might just return the favor when you need it the most. So cheers. didn't even notice until now. I mostly just listen to the music when I'm auditioning tracks for the new music hour, but this one's by Tom Baker. I guess Doctor Who uh, is also an EDM producer. That should not surprise anyone. rolled to a stop inside a level four my friends thank you for pushing it that far no caboose shot this time around <laughs> i've had a couple of shots of actual rum in me so far with 13 gift subscriptions and 234 bits thank you for pushing it as far as you can on a Wednesday afternoon. got the new version of this track which is currently only available at avianinvasion.com slash patreon my mastering engineer friend of the show and amazing producer himself Hausman has been working his ass off mastering an entire album for me and this is one of those tracks this is We Are One an avian invasion original
are not the same. But we are not that different. We are not afraid. For we are one. We are one. We are one. slash patreon and soon to be released on the upcoming album called into the trees but now we head back into the new music hour with something from vintage culture and coach harrison i hear you calling oh yes
technically new music. This is new to me, and it's a request. Matter of fact, we got a couple of requests from Pup Casey, and if you want to send in your requests for songs to play on this show, whether they're yours or somebody else's, hit avianinvasion.com slash submissions. And if it works with one of the three shows that I do every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday... Oh, I thank you very much, Andrew Connix, for tossing it there in the chat. All you have to do is hit avianinvasion.com slash submissions. We're deviating from Progressive House a little bit because this is absolutely more techno and very 80s retro. This is Funkadelica's... Wait, this, this requires reverb. By the power of Grayskull!
like a million years ago, C64 Floyd requested a little bit of singing and it took me a while to get around to a key that I could actually sing in. So here's a little something off of my debut EP called Children of the Stars. This is We Are Not There Yet. An avian invasion original.
We're heading back into the new music hour, even though we are at the end of an actual hour at this point. With Glow Walls, Eagles. Hmm. can't help you, but if you're looking for a partially robotic osprey, part human, well, I'm here for you. You can find me at avianinvasion.com. And I'm Avian Invasion pretty much everywhere on the various socials and channels. And I thank all of you who have joined me on places like Spotify and YouTube and whatnot. And of course, thank you very much to Brandy Love Music for asking me how I'm doing. I'm doing great. Of course, it may be the couple of rum shots that have been put into me. It's been a while since we've had actual hard liquor here in the chat. 
and you can now call them out via random shots or start hype trains. Thanks to Ciala, we have a couple of bottles of gorgeous, gorgeous flavored rums. One basil, one coffee. And Impistry, of course, has sent us new moonshine. Of course, that only happens if we hit one of the $500 marks on that tip jar goal as we head towards a brand new Mac Studio for the studio. We set up a few new milestones thanks to those new additions. Moonshine shots, my lord shots, and the dreaded moon lord shot to cap it off once we hit that four grand goal. In the meantime, the new music hour continues with something from Kappa. This is Pulsar.
have another request from Club Casey here in the chat. Switch. or so past the hour we're capping off the new music hour something from Guy Baroni Luke Brancaccio and Hans Bieger this is Reflections
Oh boy, Seattle is back at it with those seeds of awesomeness, which, by the way, don't cost you anything if you want to program the bird to do all kinds of weird shit here on this show. Just check the bottom of the chat. It's time for another random shot. And of course, they're calling out one of the ones that they sent my way, and I'm happy to do it. My choice of the coffee or the basil. Still playing along at home, join me in a toast, if you will, because now is the time. We're about to put some basil into the hydroponic system. As soon as we can grab some from the local farmer's market. So seems fitting that we're going to go this route with it. Once again, from Muddy River Distillery. This is Ciala's gift to the show here. My good British friend, Basil Rum. So on that note, here's to all those of you who don't care if you're alone, you dance anyway. You can't always have somebody nearby, but that doesn't mean you can't dance like you're surrounded by friends. Sooner or later, you will be back in good company. So even if you're alone right now, cheers to you for keeping the spirits high. And I do mean that literally in this case. Oh yes. I've been burping this basil rum since the first shot. I don't know why that one seems to stick around in my craw a little longer than the others, but I'm happy for it because, oh boy, is this tasty. So cheers to you. And there's it's like a, a delay fuse on this. There's a burn, and it only happens down here. It's entirely smooth on the palate. But then as soon as it hits the stomach, it's got a little bit of fire to it. Which I am okay with. Because it is mighty, mighty, mighty tasty. Thank you once again, Ciala, for sending a couple of fresh bottles my way. Salted caramel rum. Oh. Oh, wait. Maybe that's the moonshine. There we go. The infantry gift to Andraconics.
So a few minutes ago, Matt C188 spent some seeds of awesomeness for something from yours truly, and it's time I busted out a little something that I released last last year. Oh, I'm not entirely sure this was on the procedural generation EP. And this track goes out to literally all of you. Because I got nothing but love for you. This is love for you tonight. An avian invasion original.
Procedural Generation EP. That was love for you tonight from yours truly, but now we head into No Mana and IO with some of my favorite things. Just about an hour away from this show ending. There's a hard cutoff of 6.30 p.m. Pacific time, but I will be back Friday morning at 9 a.m. for the early bird breakfast for your chill vibes. So tune in while you're at work. But we still got an hour to party here.
just a mood. That's a little tipsy. Hopefully, Androconics has not been doing shots because she just finished a three hour drive back to her place. And I'm glad you made it home safe, my friend. I was falling, but you caught my wrist. Never thought that I could feel like this. Out of fire in me with your kiss. You kill the darkness. You kill the darkness. Feels like Found me in the dead of night Didn't know that I was cold inside Spectacular DJ, highly energetic, talented streamer as well. Please give them a follow if you don't mind. I believe we typically raid into them on uh, Friday mornings. Whenever possible. I'm not going to say it's time to start picking a raid target yet because we are still well over that 75 viewer mark that Twitch cares about. But we got a hard cutoff in about 45 minutes.
I'm somewhat tickled by the fact that Jade the Gecko here in the chat is asking if Mythomorph made it back from FWA OK. No, she's dead, but still typing in the chat because she's just that talented. Thankfully, she not only made it back from FWA in one piece, she also made it back to her home, her lab, where she can continue to create things that make other people happy and make the rest of us look beautiful and happy. In any case, Jade, you requested an original track. Oh, let me let the robot do it. An avian invasion original. Quite some time ago, and since we are in springtime here and it has been gorgeous for the past week, here's a little sun dance for you.
friend of the show and very talented, grotesquely talented, unfairly talented producer Hausman with his remix, Ghost. of this show before I have to close down, go upstairs, and oh no, have to sample some interesting beers. 
That's right, we do this every Wednesday. Which means it's time to start thinking about where this party is heading next. 15 minutes from now, we're going to be raiding into some channel, and I could use your suggestions. I always love your help in discovering new talent across the Twitch sphere. So please, drop me some suggestions. But the show ain't done yet.
there's definitely been some good suggestions here in the chat, and I thank you once again for two hype trains, some tips, and of course, your love, your attention, and your companionship for the last three and a half hours. minutes here barring any kind of a huge raid or some kind of other uh, stream changing event and I'm so glad you joined me for three and a half hours the music is not done yet nor am I and we apparently are going to be taking this party to lore the world after this someone I've never raided into before but 
Love it. Kemi the Grass Gal DJ's suggestion. I am absolutely down with exploring strange new worlds. Uh, <laughs> and don't worry about making me late for the beer tasting. If you guys want more music, you can make it happen. But for now, we head to a rendezvous.
slash Patreon. Look for Avian Invasion on Spotify, Mixcloud, YouTube, and everywhere dance music is sold, streamed, or enjoyed. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, Bird One reminds you that you are alive, you are beautiful, and you are not alone.